Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Prince out of Prince of YouTube back with another video. And I apologize, I was going to put this out earlier today or later on yesterday, but I did not because I was extremely busy. Just got out of my tournament. We lost, but we got a pretty dope medal. Check me out on Twitter at, at the Prince Tie two wise, just so you guys can see that medal. It's pretty dope. But um, basically, I was going to give you guys my best class setup for the Ripper. And here it is, pretty much. Rock the Ripper. I use, you know, basically whatever camo you want. I use Silencer, because I think the Silencer is a really good way to stay off the radar. And it reduces the muzzle flash, which is dope. This gun has 32 bullets, which is pretty good, uh, decently good for an assault rifle. But for an SMG, it's pretty bad. So I rock extended mags. If you think you can deal with that ammo, I would switch it out for either Grip or Rapid Fire. Because you don't really need Rapid Fire for the SMG, but it also helps because you can win those up-close battles. And it also helps for the assault rifle because the assault rifle kind of shoots slow. But that's if you even switch back and forth, you know. You got to just play it right. For my perks here, I go for uh, Dead Silence because I like being off the radar. Off the grid because I hate... I mean, Dead Silence because I like being off people's headsets if they got a good headset because a lot of people are try hard. So if I just want to hop in a game and just get a good gameplay or whatever, I have to try hard just to get a good one. So basically, I rock Dead Silence so people can't hear me with their good uh, headsets. Off the grid, so I cannot be seen on the radar. And you can also switch it out for wiretap if you don't mind. Because, I mean, technically, if you think about it, if you have wiretap, it's the same thing as off the grid because you're using theirs, so you will see them also. So, I mean, it kind of works both ways. But then also, if they do have off the grid, then you're kind of screwed. But, scavenger, you can also flip that out for full lo fully loaded. But I like scavenger. like Just because I feel like fully loaded, I go on those pretty long kill streaks. So, if I'm out of ammo on fully loaded, I know it fills it all the way, but even if you do, you can still run out of ammo that way. If you run out, I still would like to have ammo for that gun. So I rock scavenger. I don't think it's too bad. Focus, you have to have this on every class just because it's really, really helpful. One of my favorite perks ever in Call of Duty. Um, reduce weapon sway when aiming down sights and reduce flinch when hit is really good. Especially on snipers, that's good. And ping. I love ping just because it's... Um, I just kind of really, I just, I don't know, I like, I, I think it's a pretty good uh, perk. It's one of my favorite perks ever. Uh, to also, because you can, you know, you, I'm saying you can kill somebody and then know somebody else is there. But it also kind of sucks that they have off the grid. But if you kill somebody, if they pop on their, if you haven't, pretty much what I'm saying is if you haven't used it, make sure you use it. But um, as you guys can see, I use Trinity Rocket, Battle High, and Helo. And that's because I go on those long kill streaks just because if you have an assault rifle, you don't have to worry about those long range engagements. I think the Ripper is probably one of my favorite guns as uh, as of now. So basically, that's my overview on what it is, and um, I'm gonna be trying to rush for this ice uh, gold camo soon. So I'm gonna start actually trying for this gold camo. So keep you guys uh, tuned in with that. So make sure you guys take care, guys. Peace.